it going guys? It's Nathan from Nathan ZLI Garage and today we're going to be doing a review on the Harbor Freight hose clamps. Alright guys, so we're going to review these hose clamps from Harbor Freight. Now this is the problem I have working on BMWs, working on cars all the time. You always have a struggle finding hose clamps, finding enough hose clamps, finding hose clamps the right size. So here a few months ago is a Harbor Freight and I bought a box of these. This is actually my second box. And these are called, and you can see it or not, if it's focused, it is Storage House. And these are automotive hose clamp assortment. There's 40 hose clamps in here. These are, I believe, around $5, give or take. And these are made in China, so they are, you know, cheap made hose clamps. But the question is, everything I got off eBay before is made in China. You try to tighten the clamp down and it strips out, it snaps off, or it just doesn't work in the first place. So whenever I threw... A few dollars a, a box of these I thought you know it's worth a shot for five bucks if you go to Ryler's AutoZone it's really hard to buy hose clamps are cheap they're very expensive and most of the time they're the same clamp as these so these come in a nice little carry box so they're not spilling all over your toolbox you flip it open and it has all these sizes now keep in mind they have two different boxes of these one's a real has real big clamps in it and this is a smaller assortment so these are half inch, uh, inch and three eighths, inch and a half, one inch, seven eighths, three quarter, five eighths, and inch and a sixteenth. And they pretty much have, you know, just about everything you need, short of radiator hoses. Now, if you need the radiator hose clamps, the bigger clamps, the other box does have that. It is the same brand as this, and this is by no means an endorsement for Harbor Freight. I'm just trying to help you guys out. You know, a lot of you mechanics always ask me the same question. Do you have any hose clamps laying around? I always have to say no. But here lately, I've been able to tell them, you know, go to Harbor Freight, buy a box of these things. You know, you'll use them. Use them on a daily basis. So what I do, I don't use them right out of the box. I'll use a little bit of PP Blaster or WD-40. Before I even try to undo it or tighten it up, I'll squirt a little square WD-40 or PP Blaster in there. And what that does that actually frees it up. Now I did have noticed here on these clamps, I have two other clamps where I have a BMW OEM clamp and I have a Toyota one. And obviously Toyota and Honda pretty much look the same. Let me go ahead and flip this shut. I'm gonna set that off to the side so you can hopefully see a little better here what I'm talking about. Uh, obviously the BMW clamps have a little smaller head to them and the Toyota ones almost always have a 10 millimeter head if they're the bigger ones. Even a lot of the smaller ones do, or an eight millimeter head. So you can see on the difference here on these clamps is the one on the right is a Harbor Freight clamp. Uh, if you go to use a socket on it, it is a little bit funky. I don't know why that's not focusing. There you go. Uh, it does have a tendency to round off pretty easy. You can see the, the points your socket goes on, they look pointy in the camera, but they're a little bit rounded. And then of course, this guy here is a little bit better. There we go. And you could actually hog down that pretty good. Now, the straight slot part of this, I like this because if you look at the factor BMW clamp, it's hard to see on the camera. Uh, the BMW clamp, the slot for the straight blade screwdriver is not very deep and you can't strip it out. The Harbor Freight one, is super deep and I've never had one stripped so far. Most of the time you don't need to use a ratchet on it. Uh, if you're not going crazy with it, that'll work. Most of the time I just use a bigger straight screwdriver and it tightens down fine. So sorry about the short video today, but that's pretty much all I have for the video. Uh, we are using a set for Nathan's MRE today just because it's a nicer background. I was hoping it would focus a little better, but it may or may not have done that. But yeah, that's it. That's the review for the Harbor Freight hose clamps. Thanks for watching guys.